a trans boxer in the Olympics? The internet started accusing the Algerian Olympic boxer, Iman Khalif, of being a biological man, specifically after defeating her Italian opponent with seemingly one hard punch. Everyone started pointing to her physical features, appearing masculine. Meanwhile, Iman is a biological woman with naturally higher levels of testosterone, which does give her a biological natural advantage. She's been boxing for a long time, she has wins and losses, and no one ever made a big deal out of it. Until her Italian opponent started crying, after she lost the fight, and she started making some accusations. Iman literally had to show pictures of herself as a child to prove she's a female. Imagine that. And then later, her opponent apologized and said she made those statements because she was sad about her Olympic career. What? I guess Italians are still angry at Zidane for this World Cup final. Anyways, I do find it amazing how so many so-called feminists on the left, who have been completely silent on the whole Pali women being G-sided in Jaza, but they jumped on this Algerian woman. And they started spreading all this fake news. Someone also pointed out that, yo, she's Algerian. You know, Algeria, Muslim majority country. You think they're just gonna let a trans athlete compete? Like, that's not a thing. Also, since everyone's enraged over this fake news, how about we get enraged over something that is real? Israel. Israel. <laughs> no, but seriously. This Dutch man, Steven van de Velde. He is on the Dutch Olympic volleyball team, and he was convicted of raping a 12-year-old in 2016. But that's okay, 